how do you feel about the state of local democracy? Um, Brandeis said 100 years ago, states are the laboratories of democracy. And do you feel that that's true right now? I think it's the most important part of our democracy, actually. So many decisions are made at a local level, things like education and health and housing, the, the basic things that people need to survive. Um, I, and I think, again, here, too, there's got to be a uh, greater infusion of new people, young people, people that are idealistic, uh, that are trying to kind of change the system. One aspect of that that concerns me a lot is the demise of local news. Um, we have a range of small local newspapers in our country that are going under. Uh, and I think democracy at a local level depends on scrutiny even more than it does at the national level. And so if there isn't a local reporter digging around to see how did that contract get let, I think we're going to see a, a decline. It's really important that we find a way to save local journalism. You're absolutely right. That was one of the unintended consequences of, of the internet is that classified sections, which made a lot of money for newspapers, disappeared because of eBay and Craigslist. And so uh, local papers often covered, uh, there was a state house desk in every state capital, and those, those staffs have um, been withered by the, the, the disappearance of classified sections in, in, as sources of revenue for newspapers. So how can we get better coverage of state legislatures especially? I just, uh, I've written an article about uh, calling for a new domestic Marshall Plan. In the 1940s after World War II, we basically rebuilt European economies by pushing uh, billions of dollars into, into those countries. Uh, I think we have to have a new model uh, that includes both big philanthropists, the richest people in our society, foundations, and companies to come together to basically underwrite local journalism. I don't think what we're doing now is a kind of piecemeal approach and big media companies um, that are trying to survive in these local markets are really struggling. I think we have to take a fresh look at that and really try to save local journalism. Um, the number of journalists in the United States over the last 10 or 12 years has diminished by 45 percent. Wow. Uh, and so you see, not only do we have the internet with a lot of false information, but the people who really produce news, people that got a journalism degree and know about editors and all that, they're declining dramatically. There were 71,000 journalists 15 years ago. Now there's less than 40,000.